cat lovers and feline friends, it's time for Adele Park's Quirky Catnips. Did you know there is more than one kind of cat house in Las Vegas? After more than 20 years of just saying no to cats, my lawyer, who happens to be my husband's oldest son, did me a solid by talking his dad into letting me score a wee little kitty. Since both father and son are attorneys, the terms of the agreement were set up through arbitration. The resulting amicus curie brief stated that said feline must be of a low dander, low shed quality. A quick search of the internet revealed most of the hypoallergenic breeds look like the sort of animals fancied by Dr. Evil in the Austin Powers movies. The only type I could envision sharing my lap with were the Siberians, which ironically have long hair. I found a cattery in Las Vegas offering a variety of sweet balls of expensive fluff. I was a little surprised to learn the cat house had stipulations of its own. For starters, I had to fill out a lengthy application which required that I submit no less than three references which they actually called. Who knew you had to pass a background check in order to visit a cat house in Las Vegas? The discovery requests by the cattery also sought information about whether we rented or owned our house, had other animals, or liked the color yellow. I thought that last one was a little weird, but I answered yes, hoping that wouldn't trip up my adoption case. Depositions were scheduled during which I was interviewed by the madam of the cat house. Their position regarding my purchase of a pussy was laid out in a lengthy stipulation which I was required to sign under penalty of law. Some of the terms included a promise not to declaw her, which we would never do given that we're not monsters, as well as some rather nitpicky items, such as agreeing to give her bottled water. Never mind that we drink out of the tap. We then had to make a large down payment and wait until our kitten was 17 weeks old and had been spayed before we were allowed to bring her home. After taking out a second mortgage on our property and making yet another drive to Las Vegas, we were finally cleared to be cat parents. The lesson here is that if you visit a cat house in Vegas, bring a ton of money and expect to jump through a lot of hoops. The pets and purrs you're rewarded with are well worth the effort. If you thought that was off the wall, listen to me, Skitters the Cat, in Splat, a quirky cat audiobook by Adele Park. Find out how a quirky cat like me gets tangled up with another kitty from a polygamous cult in Utah. Splat is one quirky cat tale you won't want to miss. Prance over to Amazon and Audible.com and get your copy of Splat, a quirky cat audiobook.